Here we are on our glorious summer day, father and son. My name is Theodore Anthony Nugent. This is Rocco Winchester Nugent. Congratulations on Rocco Moon, Loner You Are, your brand new music CD album. Yes. Congratulations, son. Thank you, thank you. Identify one of the songs on uh, Rock a Moon, Loner You Are. Loner You that, Are. Loner You Are. That maybe is your favorite or one that you think uh, makes the boldest statement, and what is that statement? Um, the song that probably, like, summarizes the, the album best is One Deep, just because it, <clears throat> it, uh, it's, it's the same theme and the same color scheme and the same, you know, energy as the whole album and then every song pretty much is just uh it's it's a subsidiary of that energy but one deep is probably the best i mean the the album is you know loner you are referring to you know a solitude one deep referring to a solitude so that's probably the best the best depiction or summarization of the album okay um i notice in your music you've got all kinds of fascinating chordal structures mm -hmm. and variations but you never had any formal classic musical training tell us about and i'm fascinated as your dad and as a musician how did you come upon that did you just start stumbling on keyboards and find things that were desirable to your ears i literally was living in las vegas and had the inclination to go make a beat and when it got a 30 dollars midi keyboard and wanted to make a beat i just had a desire to and um i remember the first beat i played to david crowder he was just like hold on you don't know what you're doing and i was like i don't he's like but you don't, you, that's a pre-chorus and that's a chorus and then that's a breakdown and that's a bridge. And I was like, it just sounds right. So I didn't know any of that terminology. I didn't even know about four counts, but uh, the first time that I had made, sat down and put my hands on a keyboard to make it, it felt, it sounded good when I put, uh, you know, two black keys and then one key in between. I didn't know what they were called, but it just sounded good with these three and then ends up being a triad and these three chords and, and then this ends up being a, a, a minor seventh and I don't know, I don't actually know the names of them, but it sounds good and it feels good. So. Hallelujah. Congratulations. That's called Instinctive Primal Scream Musical Adventure where you let your ears and your own taste buds, musical taste buds, direct you. So congratulations on that again. Now with this new CD, is this a CD, Rocco Moon, mm -hmm. Loner You Are, yeah. you can go into a record store and buy it, you get it online, yeah. iTunes, what do you do? No, you can just go to roccomoon.bandcamp.com and you can download it and uh, it's for free. So we can celebrate your musical um, dreams and your musical movement in life on our Spirit of the Wild TV show. Mm -hmm. So you were bombarded with the passions of your family, right. your mom's quality of life and love and her exercise and health regimen, which I also shared, and my passion for hunting and carrying on to Chuck Berry Bo Diddley dream. Mm -hmm. What role did the ultimate primal scream of being self-sufficient, learning about nature and as a hunter and as a predator, did that have a role that we can hear in your music? Because obviously it helps be, make you independent, knowing you can sustain yourself with your own hands. Yeah. Um, does it have an influence in your music beyond you as an independent man? I don't think that if there is something that exists in you, you can ever get away from it. Even It's, it's probably subconscious. Especially that powerful. Yeah, especially you that powerful. You admit it's that powerful with Yeah, you? yeah, yeah. Um, I mean, that was one of the main principalities that I was raised on. So yeah, there's there's... Uh, there's a song on the album called Hunger, which is based on that completely, that same, that it's literally the hook goes, I can do it on my own, no, 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 so that's independence. It's, 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 it's interesting, like, it's a combination of, uh, you know, like a, a, a Claude Debussy, you know, uh, some, like a Beethoven concerto or Thelonious Monk ramble, plus, uh, some Ted Nugent, you know, grandiose fire proclamation. So there's well kind of said. there's kind of this sadness within this independent thing. That that was kind of the combination that I found. Yeah. Well, you're a great musician, a great hunter, and a great son. Thank you. The 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 name, the words, spirit uh -huh. of the wild. Uh -huh. Even if we weren't hunters, and we weren't conservationists and people of the earth. The word spirit of the wild could apply just to a musical driving force, couldn't it? Spirit of the wild, yeah. Yeah. My friend Hassan has a song called Wild Life, which is a completely different interpretation, but it's the same type of thing where it's there's this wild 
animalistic primal thing yes. that's inside of us. Yes. Yeah. Yeah. Which, if not tame, can be very destructive. Yes. We should be a reasoning predator, not just like a wolf or an eagle that just snags all kinds of stuff, eats only the prime uh, meat and then leaves it to rot because they're not reasoning. They don't care. They're just looking for food and they like to kill stuff. We like to kill stuff, but we only do it if we do it in a respectful and reasoning predator fashion. Yeah. So you do that same thing with your music. Congratulations, son. Thank you. Rocco Winchester Nugent, now known as Rocco Moon. Yeah. yeah. The lo- not the loner you are, just loner you are. Loner you are. Rocco Moon at yeah. bandcamp.com. That's it. It's just me and the moon, me and the moon, yeah. I'm one deep, one deep, yeah. One deep.